Good, good morning and welcome to another day here on planet Earth. I am your Merry Gardener and this is Medium Latte Extra Hot episode 166. And up on my screen is a business card. So I'm in a forum. Uh, so this, um, I'll, scroll, I'll scroll you through here, look. The forum's called I Need a Gardener UK and it's a lot of gardeners put all of their, um, they, they basically advertise themselves. Um, and, and people local to those areas will, will, will go on there on, on the forum and then and see who's like advertising their services if they're looking for a gardener. It's quite cool, it's quite handy, it's quite, it's quite a few people on there. And uh, a lot of the time you get people posting their leaflets and flyers and business cards and website and stuff like that. It's a really good place to kind of just to get a feel for where, um, especially for me, for a designer, to see um, um, just what kind of level people are at so I can potentially approach them and help them. Um, but in this, it, it, I'm, I'm kind of in the early stages at the moment. I'm, I'm, I'm kind of building up my confidence, getting back into design. And I thought um, I'm gonna do some more critiques of business cards. And this one caught my eye. And it caught my eye because it's very unique and I've liked elements of it, but there's elements that I didn't like. And um, I was intrigued to the point, because this monkey, to be honest. so. This is obviously his business card. And my immediate thought was when I was reading this, so SM Garden Services, is your garden junkie call on Stephen Monkey? So I'm like, who's Monkey? Which genuinely interests, because I, I, I posted that question. I, I went on there. Um, let, me, let me see if I can find it. I, I'll show you exactly. Let's skip through. Here you go. So I posted on here. Uh, first off, I said, who's monkey? And no one replied. And someone would put a laugh emoji. So I thought, like, maybe he thought I was taking the mick. Uh, taking the monkey. Uh, so I said, I like it. It's unique. Was curious. And uh, he gave me a thumbs up. And um, he told me. Uh, I've, yeah, I've, I've, I've hidden his name. He told me it's it. my dad. So his English isn't that great. I don't know why. Um, so it's, I'm going to try and read it so it sounds a bit better. It's my dad's nickname for when he was younger and it's done us well and got us lots of work. And I think that's, that makes complete sense to me because it is unique and the fact that that makes it even better that that monkey is like his dad's nickname. So when I look at this from a design point of view, I'm thinking, there's the thing that jumps out is the Stephen Monkey. I would compl I would change your name. I wouldn't I wouldn't have S and S M Garden Services as your company name. I would be called Stephen Monkey Garden Maintenance or Garden Services. Stephen Monkey Garden Services. And I'd, and um, if I was redesigning your logo, which um, you can't really call that a logo. So w when you're looking at the S M Garden, he's just written that down. It's not really a logo. This is like an image. It's like it's elements that that can work if you pull all the things here that you get together. So if I redesign that logo, I would actually like to use uh, this image because I quite like it. This is an old traditional mower, a little push mower, and the monkey sat on it. And the fact that he's um, his dad's nickname is Monkey, and he's the son. I just think that would be so cool as a name, Stephen Monkey, and that would. You, with the image and the name, just those two elements, um, it's going to be memorable. And, and that's kind of what you want, really. You want to be memorable. You want to stand out from the crowd. You don't want to, because s and m and people do that a lot, which is fine. It can be professional. But um, sometimes when you stand out, and, and do you know what I mean? That, that, no one's going to forget Stephen Monkey. No one. Do you know what I mean? And, I, and Whereas SM Garden Services, it's not memorable at all. So he's, he's, he's almost got all the elements there, but he hasn't quite utilised them as maybe I would. I would. I would suggest to him if he wanted help. So I'm actually going to redesign um, this logo. And, um, or, or not, this is not really a logo there. It's kind of like a, a clip, clip art image with, do you know what I mean? So it's, it's kind of incomplete in some ways as a logo. Uh, there's no kind of business identity. He's got a quirky name, quirky image. And I just want to take that a little bit further 
Um, so I'm going to work on that myself and then uh, hopefully come up with some kind of design. I did a kind of little cheeky Facebook profile. Check out his Facebook profile. He's quite into cars and things like that and football and all that sort of stuff. So maybe I can incorporate those sort of styles. I know like with cars, um, you get kind of like badge logos. So maybe some kind of badge logo. Maybe, I don't know, I'm just trying to incorporate some of his kind of personality and likes and interests into maybe that. But subtly, not to like obvious. But... um. I'm, I, I'm, I really want to keep the, the monkey. I wouldn't want to scrap the monkey because I, I, I can imagine he quite likes that. And he said that it's done us well. So I think if it's done you well, then then elaborate on that. Make that make that the pure focus because I think that's what would, people would like. And it's very quite it's quite cute that it's him and his dad. And um, yeah, I, I really like that. Um, I've just realised. <laughs> actually haven't screen recorded i've done this again don't worry i'll chuck it on i'll uh, i'll have to screen record it and chuck it on there um guys it's absolutely papping it down today i'm really like ugh. when it's raining it's hard to get your butt out the door so i've got the waterproofs in the van and we're just gonna have to crack on i hope you guys have a wonderful day and you push through a lot of the time when you push through in the rain it doesn't last too long and um Grab yourself a spare shirt, change shirt midway through the day. Makes you feel a lot better and it's good for your mental health because it feels like you've started the day again. Um, and see you later. Take care, people.